Okay, so bad news. My uh, my house is falling apart. <laughs> ah, I can't keep up. <laughs> I gotta turn up my sensitive. Oh man, I just got struck by. Oh my god, I got struck by lightning. <laughs> All right, guys, we are back with another episode of Icarus. This is part two. So in the last part, the first part, I made this house. It took quite a bit of time, but in this video, I'm gonna break up a lot of stuff. I broke up a lot of stuff in the last video. So this video should be a lot shorter. Also, hit that subscribe button if you are new here and if you're enjoying the series. If you guys could help me reach a thousand subscribers, I'd really appreciate that. We're around a hundred away. I literally just crafted this bone knife, so let's see how good they are against this level 39 Komodo. Oh, he's angry. He's angry. Okay, so it, it did take a lot of wear, it did. Not not as bad as the stone knife. The stone knife was just terrible. But I get it, you know, just starting out. But I just now put a uh, point towards the bone knife, and it, it was significantly better than stone knives. Alright, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful scenery. Man, this is amazing. I gotta do some upgrading on the house, too, because I'm not liking these, these uh, beams I have. They are not even at all. For the most part, they kind of are, but look, there's that one there, and then that one looks like it's not even it's not even touching the the base. So yeah, I definitely got some upgrading to do on the house, but I'm thankful I at least have a house with a bed in it. So when it gets dark, I can just sleep, and night will turn into day. Like this right here, I I don't know how that happened. I mentioned it in my last video at the end. I, yeah, I don't know how that happened. I imagine probably weather, because I think weather can do that. So, needless to say, I can't wait until I'm able to build stone walls and flooring. Alright, so we're getting some bad weather right now. We have a storm, so uh, we'll see if it does any damage to the house. Any further damage, that is. I have to repair that if I can. So, we'll see. So I just put this fireplace in my house. I fear it'd do more lighting than that, but hopefully it does no damage to my house at all. Hopefully my house won't burn down. I don't have it too close to the wall or anything, so we should be good, hopefully. I don't know if my house is going to hold up though. I hear like creaking and shaking. Maybe we should go out and take a look. Oh wow, it's dark out. I didn't think it'd be this dark. Okay, I'm thirsty. So I gotta get something to drink. And then I gotta eat. So I wanna cook some uh, meat on that fire that I got. Okay, so bad news. My uh, my house is falling apart. <laughs> oh man, I was not expecting this. The weather is tearing my house apart. Oh man, like I get realism in a game, but what the heck? <laughs> this is insane. This is this is next level realism in a survival game. Oh man, this is insane. Okay, can I put my torch down somewhere? I don't I don't want to put my torch down and then it like destroys my house. Oh, this is insane. I I got to start repairing. This is bad. Oh man. <laughs> ah, I can't keep up. <laughs> <laughs> the rain is literally coming through. I, I, I'm, I gotta say, I'm loving the realism in this. I really am. If you want realism in a survival game, you gotta get this game. This game is so realistic. I, I kind of want to watch where I'm holding my torch because I don't want it to, like, catch on fire. Because you can do that to trees. I showed that in my last video. You hold a torch up to a tree, it will, uh... It will catch stuff on fire, so I don't know if that'll do it to my house or what. Look at that. 
That's insane. All right, so the sun is finally coming out. Look at that. I love how it actually reflects off the ground you know, as the sun rises. That, that is so cool. All right, well, yeah, the sun's up. The storm is gone. I, I got to get repairing on that house. So right now, I'm just collecting some wood. Okay, so that's repaired, but look at it. It don't really look repaired. It's all cracked up. It says durability 1,000 out of 1,000. So why doesn't it look like that? Because obviously... Same with that one. Th those are the two I've been having issues with. So I don't understand why it looks like that. That one too. Look at that the little cracks. In. Is it just because it's been... Is it just because... It's been repaired before, but these look all normal. Ah, that one's in it too. Huh. Okay, I have no idea. I know I want stone, and I have plenty of stone to be able to do it. So, when you walk up to a, a wall, I notice, or probably in floor, yeah. You can do this. You can do stone, concrete, thatch, aluminum, glass, wood, and interior wood. Well, I want to do stone, but I can't figure out how to do it. Like, I'll do this, and I'll stop. And you think, okay, you can do it. No, it won't let me. Even if I have stone in my inventory, if I move stone over, I don't know what it requires to be able to do stone. It's not telling me. I need some wood too, because I got wood, I got stone and wood in my inventory. I want to upgrade it. I don't know if there's something I got to get inside the tech tree. I, don't, I didn't see stone though. Obviously here's thatch, here's wood. Okay, then when you go tier 2, I'm still, oh, okay, stone furnace. I'm still iron, iron axe, you know. Ah, I wonder if I need that. A sturdy construction bench, though useless without shelter. A heavy woodworking table that enables construction of improved tools, weapons, and structural elements. So I wonder if I need that. If that's, if that's the case, I gotta be level 10 to get to tier 2. I'm wondering if I need that because I, I just want to be able to do stone. Stone walls. And I'm not, I, I mean, I'm looking closely and I'm not seeing any stone. Leather curtain door. Stone wall right there. Wow. Okay. Okay, that's going to take, that's going to take a lot of leveling up. 15 to get to that. Ugh. That's going to take some time to get to that. So it definitely won't be this video. It's going to take some time to get to level 15. Look how long it took me to get to level 5. That was an over an hour video. Well, alright then. I guess I gotta suck it up and just keep repairing. Don't really have any options there. So... I have to keep an eye on uh, the house with the storm and stuff going on. Because I, I don't want my whole house to get destroyed. So I guess I'm going to have to keep a bunch of wood on hand and... Hope for the best. Yes, yeah, see those are see they look so weak, but they're fully repaired. Yeah, just gonna have to watch out, I guess. So it's just definitely gonna take some time to get to that level 15 I need for the stone. Looks like we have a bear over there. Do I dare go on and try and getting him and getting getting a little redemption from that one bear that killed me? You guys remember that last episode? Should I go over there and try to get a little redemption? Looks like a bear. Oh yeah, definitely a bear. He has his little friend, the Komodo, with him. You know what? Screw it. Yeah, let's let, let's try it. Oh, we got them all good and pissed off now. This is why I just start. Oh. 
Oh, yes. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> and then I can take some of my bone knives back. There we go. Got a little redemption on that. He has a level 13. Oh, I look at all that fiber I have. Okay, so ooh, I got 18 fur off him. Was I able to take it all? Okay, so... Oh, let me go get rid of some of this fiber. <laughs> there he is. Look at him. Little idiot. You don't look so tough now, do you? Huh. Why am I using that? I, I don't know why. It's just a habit of taking the knife and using it. Oh my god, what was that? Don't tell me that's another bear. Oh, just Komodo. I didn't know if that was another bear trying to get some little redemption on me or what. <laughs> Bad weather is coming. Wow. Okay, so do not use that this time. This is always a habit to use the. What the hell was that? What was that? Was that lightning? Oh man, I hope it don't strike my house. If it strikes my house, my house is done for. Hopefully don't strike me. Don't strike me. Oh, I better get inside. My house is my ha my house is so screwed. Oh man. Yeah, my house is so screwed. What the heck? Is that gonna be an episode? Oh man. It's gonna be like that episode of SpongeBob when uh who gets struck by lightning? What the heck? Okay, that sounded like something like alien like. Who who who's that one that gets struck by like lightning on SpongeBob? He like gets fried. What was that? I'll have to look that up. I I it just it's not ringing a bell right now. See, I keep missing words too. That sounds like alien like laser beams. I need to turn up my sensitivity. See? I gotta turn up my sensitivity. Oh man, I just got struck by- Oh my god, I got struck by lightning! No! 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 <laughs> oh man. I, I'm definitely like that guy on Spongebob now. Meet me! Meet me! Meet me! Meet me! I'm really hoping my house don't get destroyed because this, this is terrible. This is really bad. Oh man, look at that tree over there. That tree's on fire. I told you guys. I told you. Oh man, we have more. I told you guys it happened. Should I go, uh... You know what? I don't have a fire whacker. I never did unlock it. So I guess we're just going to <laughs> watch it burn and hope it don't make its way to my house. Look at that. Now that now that the storm happened, it's it's settling down now, but... It caught some trees on fire. I could have really used them trees, too. Yeah. I guess I'm thankful it's just not my house. So, apparently this game has caves. I don't know where they are. I guess there's a bunch throughout the map. So, it'd be cool if I could find a cave. I don't even know what lurks inside the caves. I like watching uh, Cage 848 videos. That's how I found out about this game, actually. And, oh, it's getting dark, isn't it? Either it's getting dark or just because the sun isn't shining. Oh, that's the geyser over there. I saw that in my last world. I gotta be careful I don't catch any of these on fire. But see what I mean? I'll show you guys. Look at this. Shouldn't I catch on fire? Maybe it's a tree. Look at this. There you go. See? I'm telling you, the realism in this game. You gotta watch out for it. Alright. Yeah, there's a geyser over here. My oxygen's running low. <laughs> I haven't been paying attention to that. 
I better collect some oxide for that. Alright, we'll have to definitely get some more, but that'll be okay for now. Yeah, I'm wondering about the caves. I believe there's some by the rock. Is that one? Is that one? No. No. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's some caves by the rocks. I better not go in them right now, because if I do find one, I better not go in right now, because I don't know what lurks inside of them. At least not right now. Yeah, I have no idea where they are. I'll have to watch some more of, uh, Cage 848 videos. I know he's been exploring the caves and all. He's went to... I believe he just recently went to the snow biome. Uh, there's, like, some caves around in here. I saw a video where he was pointing out. This looks like it might be a cave. Oh, man, it is. Oh, man, it is. Uh, oh, what the fuck? Oh, my God, what are those? <laughs> what the shit was that? Oh, man. Ah. Yeah, oh. Man, that gave me the goosebumps. I hate snakes. Oh, man. What is this rock, though? That rock looks pretty cool. What is it? Is it iron? Oh, man. Let me drop that. Maybe I can... Maybe, maybe they'll let me take a little bit of this rock. No! Holy shit. Oh, oh, what the? Oh my god, what's he spitting at me? Oh, man. Oh. You know, I want to shoot him. I want to shoot him. Pop back up. I want to shoot you. Ah! Got him. I hit him. Got him all good and pissed off now. You little fucker. Oh, did I kill him? Oh, did I kill him? You think he'll stay dead? For me? Where's the other one at? I died. Why did I die? Yeah, guys, that... That's insane. Oh, man, I just... I just went and picked up my stuff. That... So now I'm wondering what that was in there that got dropped. Okay, it ain't in there now, that blue thing. I don't know, that's freaking freaky. I'm definitely going to have to watch some cage videos, see how he took them things down. Because that, that is bad. Holy crap. Definitely scary, I don't feel like taking them on right now. I lost a lot of XP. The next day. Alright guys, so I've given some thought and I am going to go after the caves. I'm going to go in. I have some bone knives made up. I have a couple of them. Probably going to need some more than that. But uh, I do have the basics of what I need. I want to get in there and uh, mine some of that iron. And if there's gold in there, that'd be nice. You know, whatever else. I want to mine some of that stuff so I have it. So yeah, we're just going to go ahead and go in and see what we can do. I better get some oxide first, because my oxygen is low. But just to let you guys know, this is the next day. Like, real life, like, real life, this is the next day. Yesterday, the recordings that you just saw, those are from yesterday. Like, real life yesterday. I didn't have a whole lot of footage, I stopped recording, but uh, this is a new day. I uh, watched some of Cage Cage 848 videos. I watched when he first went into the cave. All the ooh, look at that deer. Although, when he was playing, he...
He is so good at the bow. He is. Cage 848. He's so good at it. I'm terrible at it. Well, anyways. Look at that blood. Anyways, I was watching some of his videos after I stopped recording last night. And the cave that he went through. Oh, was it this? He had to, like, bust the wall out. Was it this? I don't know, but he had to break the wall open. Um, for me? <laughs> There, it's just open. This cave right here is just open. So I don't... He must have went to another cave, maybe. I, I have no idea. Oh, another thing I saw in his videos is this. You remember the first video I did this, I was complaining, saying, Oh, it'd be nice if you could uh, carry the torch. You know, and hold, Yeah, you can. You move it over here to the L. And there you go. Total, total game changer. So yeah, I did watch some of Cage videos, and I saw him going here, and he was just going at him with the knife. So I figured I'd go in here, and uh, we'll, we'll, we'll do that. Now the bad thing is, is that they do respawn. These worm snake things, they respawn. So if you go away, they will respawn. So uh, I did bring a chest. I hope to place down. And let's just uh, go in on them. Okay, I think he went into a different area. Because there's two of them right there. Three of them. Oh, man. Ah. Oh, I got, I got to recover some stamina. Oh, I died. Are you kidding me? Oh, man. Okay, so when he went in, the, the cave that he went into, it should be around here. There was... He had to, like, break the wall down. Maybe I'll have to go back and look at his video. I don't know, but he had to break the wall down. For me, this cave was just open. But the entrance that he went in where he had to break the door, like, the cave door down himself, it, uh... There was only two of them right there when he walked in, and then there's some further back. Me, I have four of these right here. Oh, man, another... Uh, another uh, XP penalty for dying. Lovely, lovely. Maybe I should... I don't know, maybe... Maybe I should see if I can find that cave wall. Alright, so let's maybe try this again. Yep, see what I mean? That's why I said they... Okay. Trying to let them hit me. Ah, you got me. You got me. That poison really screws up your stamina. Oh, man. And my health is just draining. And then I'm dead. Yeah. Wow. Okay, I gotta think some things through before I come and do this again. Because I keep getting this XP penalty. And it's gonna take me forever to level up now. Because the reason why I wanted to come in here is because on Cage's video, and he's more experienced than me with survival games, he is, but he came in here and started mining iron, and he was mining gold and copper, and it was giving him some pretty good XP. See, the way I put this bed is stupid too, because it spawns me right there. Anyways, he was getting some really good XP just by mining the iron and stuff, so... That's a big reason why I wanted to go in there and do that. But that... I gotta, I gotta figure something out. I had a little bit of food with me. I guess what I really probably need is some bandages as well. Which I do not have. I don't even have that unlocked, so... I don't know, but yeah. Uh, I'm pro... Oh, great. Right now, really, Jaguar? Really? I don't have anything to fight you off. Oh, great. See what I mean, though? They respawn. Uh. 
Yeah, I don't know. I gotta, I gotta figure something out because... <laughs> the... I don't have an issue taking that one down. But when I get back there, there's like four of... There's like three or four more right there. Like right there there is, so... I don't know. I gotta, I gotta figure something out. This, this is not okay. Just give me a little copper. Ah! <laughs> oh man, this is really something. I really want to know where he started breaking that cave. Because mine's all open right there. I don't think... I. This can't be the same. It can't be. Let me... Let me go ahead and pull up that video. I want to look for myself. And then we'll get back on with it. Okay, so what you see here is a snapshot from my gameplay. I want to show you a snapshot from KJ48's gameplay of when he first went through the caves. His video is from like a month ago. Like to the date almost. And I'm telling you right now, the visuals look the exact same. The only difference is, is the middle, what you see on mine, is open. It was already open. His, he had to bust out, you know, the wall himself. So, I don't know. And then, with the snakes popping up, I'm getting more spawning. So, I, I have no idea why. Okay, so I know the quality isn't that great, but this is a direct snip from kj 4 8s YouTube video of him going inside the caves. So, you see the rock, and you see the two trees, like, right in the middle. Well, I have that exact same thing. The only thing is, he had to break down his own door inside the, you know, the cave wall. Like, the side of the mountain to get inside. On my game, and it was like this, that's how I noticed it, it's just a big opening. I mean, all the visuals are matching up. It's the exact same trees, the exact same rock. That's the only difference is, mine's wide open, and he had to break down his, uh wall on the side of the mountain so i i don't understand okay so i just looked at his video luckily it didn't get dark yet but i just looked at his video and this is for sure the same entrance he went the only difference is his video i will say his video is from what like a month ago his video is from december 12th 2022 and today at the recording of this video is january 13th 2023 so like a month ago Okay, so, I, if I had to, because I have not messed with this cave at all. I have not messed with this cave at all. So, if I had to guess, maybe the de developers went in and opened up the whole cave. Instead of, you know, you, you know, breaking it out. But then they made it more difficult. Because they added, like, four of those in one place right there. I, I don't know. I gotta figure something out, though. Uh, Cage was talking about buff foods. I think he's just referring to foods that will help you, you know, gain your health and stamina back. So that's something I really need to, uh, be, f oh, of course, weather. Lovely. That's something I need to be, uh, I need to have on hand, which I have some things right here. I have some cooked meat and cooked stringy meat, so, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Uh, I don't really want to die again, but... Okay, got that one down. Got him down. Got him down. I have not got hit with anything. Okay, yeah, that technically hit me. Lovely. Joy, joy, joy. And just like that, I'm dead again. But yeah, this is definitely the cave that Cage was in. I'm telling you, this is the cave. It just, I, I don't know. It just seems like there's just so many more at once. Because when I was watching his video, he'd go in and there'd be two right there. You know, the one on the right side, one on the left side. He'd be able to kill those without having any of the other ones come at him yet. So I, I don't know. 
I just I'm 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 getting so many so much XP penalties, so I think I'm just gonna have to hold off because this this is bad. Let me go get my stuff. I'm just gonna take this as a fail for right now. Just just for right now. Uh we will we will venture back into the cave at some point. I'm not sure when. The storm. Hopefully don't tear my house down. Hopefully not. Let's go over here, get the stuff, and head back home, I suppose, and hope the uh, house does not... Oh, great. The stuff is, there, is in there deeper than what it was. Oh, boy. Oh, crap! Okay. Ooh, I don't know how, but I did not get hit at all. Wow. Like I said, let's, let's head back home. Uh, we'll take this on another day. Because something's, something's not right about that cave. Like I said, I did not destroy a wall in that cave. I just was searching, and then I found the wall as is. Just the cave wall like that, so... I don't know. Well, I guess that's it for today's video. Uh, that was interesting, the whole cave system. <laughs> So, if you guys are new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you are enjoying these videos. Try to help me reach my uh, goal of 1,000 uh, subscribers. I'm a little less than 100 away, so you guys are getting me really close to 1,000. And trust me, I really appreciate it. Give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy the video. And as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one.